Okay, now let's solve both these equations using the square root method again. And we have x squared equals 27. So we want to take the square root of both sides of the equation. Here we have a plus or minus 27, root 27. And the root cancels out with the square. So x is equal to plus or minus root 27. But remember that root 27, we can actually break it down into 3 root 3. 3 root 3. And why is that? Because 27, well, let me just fix this. 27 is equivalent to 9 times 3. So that's equivalent to root 9 times root 3. And root 9 is just 3. So 3 times root 3 is 3 root 3. And that's the fully simplified form of root 27. But our answer, of course, is just right here. x is plus or minus 3 root 3. What about this question? 2x squared equals 18. Before we take the square root, in this case, we actually want to divide both sides by 2. So these guys cancel out. And we have x squared equals 18 divided by 2 is 9. So x squared is 9. Now I can just take the root of both sides of the equation. And this side becomes plus or minus root 9. So x is equal to plus or minus root 9, which is 3. So x is plus or minus 3. That's all.